Welcome to Learning with eDynamic Learning. We're excited to have you join us in learning about some of the hottest topics and even about some of the hottest and high demand careers. I know you're juggling a lot of things right now, including meeting new teachers, being introduced to new expectations, and having to learn new platforms and new courses. My goal over the next few minutes is to take you on a quick tour to help you learn two primary things. First, how to access your new course on the EDL platform, and second, getting you familiar with some of the most important features on your homepage dashboard that you'll see as soon as you log in. Before we get started, it's worth me mentioning though that because the courses have been responsibly designed, you can access your course on any device. So even if it's your phone, a tablet, a laptop, or your desktop computer, you'll be able to learn however works best for you. So let's jump right in. For the first step, you'll use the URL your teacher or school provided you to get to the landing page of the platform. Enter your login credentials in the upper right hand corner of the landing page. Your username and password should have also been provided to you. If you don't have them, make sure to reach out to your teacher to get your credentials. Once you log in, you'll end up on what we call the student app homepage. Let me take you on a tour around the homepage so you can get familiar with some of the most important features you'll need to be aware of. There are three dashboard panels, courses, to-do list, and your activity stream. Let's start with the courses panel. Just like it sounds, this dashboard panel is what you will always land on after logging in. It shows all courses you have been enrolled in. Courses are displayed as tiles with a course image, the date range of how long your course will take, your current course score, a progress bar so you know how far along you are in completing the course, an activities icon which will launch your course, think of this icon kind of like opening up your textbook, and a grades icon which will open details about your grades on assignments and quizzes. On the date bar, you'll find an announcements tab. When you open your announcements tab, you'll be taken to the communications dashboard that houses all class announcements posted by your teacher. We'll explore the communications dashboard further in a different video. Let's head back to the homepage and pick up on our tour from there. Your next dashboard panel is your to-do list. Your to-do list displays any assignments that need to be completed or that are past due. Typically, the to-do list displays activities with due dates coming up within seven days. The third dashboard panel is your activity stream. Your activity stream houses all communication and information of activity in your course or courses, starting with the most recent information displayed at the top. If you are in more than one course, you have the option to filter your activity stream by course. You might be thinking, isn't this what the announcement tab is for? And you wouldn't be wrong in asking that question. What is different between your announcements and the activity stream is that the announcements are whole class announcements put out by your teacher. The activity stream is all activity important to just you. For example, yes, you will see class announcements here, but you'll also find activity updates such as your grade on assignments or quizzes, emails from your teacher, and any feedback on assignments you may have received. Click on any hyperlinks in the activity stream to open and view additional information. In this overview video, we explored two main aspects to get you started. The first being how to access your new course on the EDL platform, and the second getting you familiar with some of the most important features on your homepage dashboard that you'll see as soon as you log in. Make sure to watch the next overview video titled Navigating Your Course to learn what is expected in a typical course.